Uh, with the China imposing sanctions on the U.S. officials, and not for the first time, uh, is, is this a sign that the Beijing can counter what appears to be the United States' hegemonic goals in the region over there? Yes, on, on the one hand, it um, is said to be a tit-for-tat response, but the character is somewhat different, if you notice. Um, one thing, sanctions that are uh, permissible under international law generally have to have a character that they're um, proportionate to what they're responding to, and they're part of some efforts to conciliate or resolve the problem, whereas the unilateral coercive measures that are generally considered illegal are those that are attempting to coerce some political change, to hurt whole populations and to affect third parties. And I think you'll find that, generally speaking, the U.S., what the U.S. calls sanctions, fall into the latter category, the unilateral coercive measures. And what China is doing now is much more limited and responsive to U.S. actions. Okay, Ching Dao Ju uh, also joins us. Ching Dao, uh, you know, the White House works uh, person described uh, the uh, Jen Psaki, she described the China's sanctions as outrageous and claiming that the U.S. officials that China had targeted only promoted democracy and human rights. Are the sanctions outrageous and are the officials targeted, had they been promoting only democracy and human rights? Uh, well, first of all, obviously, the U.S. side is not happy with uh, the retaliatory measures from the Chinese side. And keep in mind, it is the U.S. Uh, which initiated this uh, sanction war, if we can call it, uh, against China over Hong Kong, over Xinjiang, over a lot of issues. Uh, remember, China uh, very uh, uh, is responding and is taking measures to defend its interests. So these measures are defensive in nature. Uh, secondly, I would say, uh, look, um, in Hong Kong, the U.S. using human rights and freedom, we know that as uh, almost as a political tool to intervene, to interfere in the internal affairs of another country. In this case, it's by the Hong Kong, it's by the China's Hong Kong.